Hey guys, it's great seeing you today. How are you? It's great being seen by you. Argentina, eh? Argentina in the house. Have you ever been here? I went to some deep pockets of Argentina. Nice memories. I love Argentina. Well, Jack, first of all, what a great film debut. You're used, I guess, to the stages, but I imagine that the acting must feel something different. So how was this first time on set for you? It was really good. I mean, speaking as Jack, I, I know how often you don't get these opportunities. So to step in and do something different from what I've done before and being able to be so creatively in it, um, I look forward to doing more of it. And I look forward to doing more of it well. This is a remake of White Man Ken John, but did you see the previous movie? I personally saw it. I liked it. I was nervous, but I said, let's do it. Mm. You? I had never seen it. I watched it really? once we walked the set. And what difference did you find? Original, I liked the texture of how it was shot. But we had no choice but to try and tell a new story. You know, we couldn't try and redo it because there's no, there's no topping the original. But what we could do was tell our version and tell a modern version. Tell a 2023 version. And that's what we set out to do because, as you know, the times keep changing. The times, they keep on changing. So we got to move with it. How do you get along with sports? I love playing sports. Um, what people don't know is I actually, as a kid, wanted to be a sports writer. And so sports is a real part of my life. Soccer I love very dearly, basketball too. Um, and the opportunity to do this was amazing because it was just something I'd already loved already. The story revolves around a basketball tournament uh, and an important prize. So I wonder, do you remember what did you do with the first important money that you earn from your jobs? That's a great question. Hmm. We haven't got that question. They usually so. pay me for that. That was a great question. That was, that was a great question. You stumped us. This is the second time you guys are telling me this, so... I feel pretty good. You stumped us. You're a good interviewer. You, you flipped it on us. You saw what we were doing and you did it different. So I'll put it to you like this. I used to love going to Applebee's a lot. Applebee's? What is that? You're making fun now. Right? I'm not. Applebee's is a restaurant near my high school and I used to take my boys up there and we would get milkshakes. And I'm dead okay. ass. Every Friday. Pretty generous from you to take your friends, right? Thank you. I know what he's gonna say. I think he doesn't want to say it. Just say it. Just say it, man. No, man. He's nervous. I don't know what I did with my first check. Why wouldn't you tell me? I, you, we, you no one's ever asked us that question, so I don't have the answer. Amsterdam, red light district. <laughs> oh, I As get Jack. it. I get it. Perfect. I totally get it. And would you consider yourself uh, generous, or do you know how to save money? Definitely know how to save money. Um, Generous. Generously. What's your uh, guilty pleasure? You already know his. <laughs> Me, personally, I like to give back to the community, kids, you know, charities. Yep. That's my guilty pleasure. Him, nice. you already know his. Amsterdam. <laughs> I'm sure. I, I've never I'm, been there. I'm giving all my ge money generously to Amsterdam. <laughs> I can't wait to come back to Argentina. I want to do a, a real life interview. You'll do it with me. I'll do it with you. Buenos Aires. Yo entiendo mate que hablo. Hola. ¿Entiendes español? Un poquito, un poquito. Un poquito. No, hablo un poquito, pero entiendo mucho. Quiero saber cómo aprendiste a hablar español. Yo estudio español uh, cuatro años en la uh, universidad. Ah, pretty good. I'm totally impressed. I didn't know that. Novias. Novias de dónde? Latinas de dónde? Sí, 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 sí. Follow me. Frase favorita en español. Well, mm, uh, <laughs> it's a tough, <laughs> it's a tough call. Um, Muy difícil. Lo siento, pero no lo siento. We're putting romantic here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> lo siento. Or I like to say, más despacio, no hablo. I know that you dedicated a song to Dua Lipa. I did. Who would you like them to uh, dedicate a song to you? Elton John. Ah, oh, we're too. Thank you for this time, and we'll hope to see you in Argentina someday. Or in Amsterdam, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Come on over to Amsterdam. Gracias. Bye, guys. Bye.